Hello, 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 and welcome to Tuck's Take, brought to you by PlaySugarHouse.com. Nobody, and I mean nobody, does live in-game betting like PlaySugarHouse.com. What an amazing job Frank Reich has done in Indianapolis. Andrew Luck retires at the 11th hour, and instead of feeling sorry for themselves, instead of listening to all the experts that said they couldn't win, Reich has rallied this team around Jacoby Brissett and an underrated defense that's so much better when Darius Leonard is in the lineup. On the other side of the field, we've got a team in Denver that's trading away pivotal pieces. Whether it's intended or not, management is clearly telling the locker room, we don't believe in you. I don't believe in Denver either. You know who I do believe in? Frank Reich. Give me Indianapolis. All this time, we thought Tennessee's wide receivers weren't any good. Turns out it wasn't the receivers. It was Marcus Mariota. Ryan Tannehill isn't Tom Brady, but he makes this offense far more balanced, and that's all they need with Derrick Henry running the ball. At home, Tennessee minus two and a half is the play. Did I miss the memo? Did Pittsburgh suddenly get a quarterback? Is Big Ben back? So why in the world are they point favorites over a Miami squad that's still playing hard? Take Miami and the points. That's going to do it for this week's edition of Tuck's Take. Until next time, I'm David Tuckman. Enjoy the games, and good luck.